So good morning you guys. I feel like this is the first time that I'm actually talking in the video. I was just, I woke up, I was in a little bit of just, uh, you know, I just didn't feel like talking, didn't feel like doing anything. So yeah, but anyways, hello, good morning. Actually, it's not even morning. It's like afternoon. What time is it? Where is my phone? Okay, so it is 3.30 sorry the sirens were like going off but anyways it is 3 30 in the afternoon and i literally just started my day like did you not like i literally woke up like probably about like half an hour ago like when you saw me like make up my bed and like do my whole skincare routine that was like me just waking up so i woke up at around like 2 50 and i'm now getting my day started which absolutely sucks because last night I had like this whole thing and I'm like, does anybody else have like that thing where like the night before they're like, I'm going to be so productive. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. And then they wake up and they're like, yeah, nah, that's not happening for me today because that is literally what just happened. But I'm kind of stressing out because I have a lot of stuff to do and this vlog was supposed to be like a productive daily vlog, which it still can be. You know, we can still be productive in the middle of the afternoon, so I'm still going to do that. But I have a lot of stuff to do, and I'm stressed. But I am very, very hungry right now because, like I said, I just woke up. And I was going to make breakfast, but since it's not breakfast time anymore, I guess I'm going to have lunch, which isn't too bad because I actually went out with my cousin last night. So I have leftover pasta from the restaurant, and honestly... I love leftover pasta. I don't know what it is, but it just tastes 10 times better the next day. So I'm going to eat because I am literally starving. And then after that, we are going to get some work done because I have a lot of shit to do. finally got some leftover pasta i don't remember what this was when i got it at the restaurant i think it smells like pesto so it's definitely like some type of like pesto alfredo but i literally took the smallest bite it is so good like i don't know if it's because i'm hungry or it just genuinely tastes amazing but it is so good so i am going to the rest of my pasta and i'm the type of person that i need to watch a show while I am eating so I'm just gonna turn on the TV because yes I have a TV in my room everyone needs a TV in their room I'm just gonna go on Netflix and look for something to watch while I eat my food and then finally once I'm finished eating my food we will then finally finally get into doing some work because I have a lot of shit I need to do. I'm gonna figure out a Is it show to watch. Oh, you know what I actually might watch? It's the ultimatum, marry or move on. I don't know, it's like part of like the top 10 on Netflix right now and I heard a lot of people talking about it so I might as well just watch the first episode because right. why not? I remember my cousin was talking about this show and apparently she said that it has something to do with like like six couples come in and they all come in as couples and then there's like an ultimatum that they have to do. I don't really know what's going on or something but it's just drama and I'm a type of person that I love watching drama. I love drama other than my own drama but I love watching other people's drama so 
it sounds like a show that's made for me so i'm gonna watch it and finish my food i'm gonna watch an episode maybe we'll see how long an episode is how long is an episode <sighs> let's see 57 minutes okay that's kind of long but maybe i might watch half an episode and then as a treat i'll watch the other half when i'm done at the end of the night so yeah but i'm gonna eat my food because i'm hungry and i'm gonna watch this because i'm very 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 intrigued by what's going on in the show because right now it's top 10 on netflix so that means it has to be good because anytime i've ever watched any show that's top 10 on netflix it's always been a one so let's check it out i'm not ready to get married yet choosing one person for the rest of your life that's a pretty big choice i don't really believe in there only being one person for everybody do i think that there's a possibility that i could be happy with somebody else yes i think it's natural to wonder what it would be like to be in a different relationship Oh my god so i just finished watching the first episode of the show that i was talking about and remember how i was like oh yeah like i'm only gonna watch 30 minutes until i finish eating i got so invested that show is so messy i don't even know how to like explain the plot of like what's going on if you have netflix which i feel like everybody does and you just need to watch that show because there's a lot of drama i'm just like wow like what's going on but anyways now i have to actually be serious with my life and start studying but literally look at my desk right now like look at this it literally looks like a complete mess i don't know how i function i don't know how i live like this but yeah um i should probably clear up my desk and then and then after i clear up my desk i'll finally get into studying <laughs> literally look at this mess how do i like function with my life like why do i have a pack of parmesan cheese on my desk like what am i doing with my life god damn <laughs> Like the fact that I have um, dishwasher detergent on my desk is very concerning. Like, what is going on? What is going on? finally can start studying as you guys can tell i've been prolonging this and putting this off for literally the entire day because i hate studying but there's a lot of things that i need to do i have three assignments well three four three or four I have three essays that are due one's due on the 11th another one's due on the 14th and then the third one's due on the 16th and right now it's the 9th and i haven't started any of them and they're all eight page essays which i'm a little bit scared for so my goal of today is to at least do two pages minimum of one of the essays probably the one that's due the soonest which is the one that's due on the 11th because um i'm a little bit nervous and i'm a little bit scared i don't know how i'm going to be able to do this but i need to start so that is what i'm going to be doing so put my phone on a timer for one hour and we'll see how much i get done in that hour and then i'll give myself a 20 minute break and then do another hour but my goal is to study for at least three hours with 20 minute breaks in between and then hopefully i can get some sort of progress 
done. So let's see how well that works. But anyways, three, two, one, timer is set and it is time to study. just finished studying for about an hour my timer literally just went off like two minutes ago and i literally got a page and also started the second page i also transitioned from the desk to the bed because the bed is just much more comfier probably not good for my back but you know whatever and i actually was able to write a whole page and a tiny bit which is crazy how much you can do in an hour when you just focus and this is a four page paper so i'm thinking i can probably get it done tonight if i focus but right now i need a little bit of a break because i have the attention span of literally a five-year-old i can only really study continuously for half an hour to an hour and then after that i need to take like a break in between it just doesn't work for me if i don't take a break so i'm going to take my 20 minute break probably will watch a youtube video oh rem do you guys see that rem actually came out with a new youtube video i love her she's like one of my favorite youtubers that i watch i've been watching her for since forever and her vlog is around 22 minutes long so it's perfect because it's the right amount of time for me to take my break and then i'll get back into studying Hello. So, as you guys can see, it is a couple days later. I know, I am such a fail. Literally, I think the last thing that I showed you guys is that I was going to... What was I going to do? Oh, I was going to, like, watch a YouTube clip and then get back to studying. Yeah, that never happened, unfortunately. I ended up watching literally youtube for the rest of the day and i didn't finish my assignment and i still left it to the last minute even though i even started it early i just realized that i'm not a get shit done early kind of person i'm just a last minute kind of person so yeah that was a fail but um i still decided you know what i can still make this vlog something i don't know what i'm gonna name it now because at first i was gonna name it get like productive with me and like finish my assignments on time or something of like that sort but now i don't know what to do now this is just gonna turn into a random vlog so yeah that was a fail but anyways i still actually have a lot of work to do um right now it is actually exam season for me so there's a lot of stuff that i need to study for i actually have two assignments that are due both in two days that no i have not started yet which is absolutely insane like why do i do this to myself so i at least have to finish one my goal is to finish one essay a day they're both six pages long so let's see how well we can do that but i am actually stressing right now and honestly it's nobody's fault but my own because who the fuck leaves two essays 
two days before they're due like no one except for me so that's what we're gonna have to do right now so um yeah anyways oh my god i tried this new hair look i tried to like do some like i don't know i don't know i was trying to do like that like you know what they say like that sexy secretary like half up hair vibe or hair up kind of vibe yeah i tried to do that i just feel like it looks like shit but you know here's a side profile i don't know does it look cute probably not but whatever i'm not even going anywhere so it is what it is this hairstyle is not as cute as i thought it was going to be but oh well i'm only staying at home anyways um i need to get to studying so let's go and do that right now so i am going to put on a timer for one hour you can see the reflection can you see that but anyways three two one and time to start studying intermission why is it snowing in the middle of april it is currently april 18th and this is what it looks like outside what a day to be alive this is what it feels like to be canadian wow tragic hello you guys hi how are you <laughs> if you guys know where that's from all I have to say is we're best friends. If you don't know, that's tragic. But anyways, I am just popping up right now to end this vlog because I realized that while I was editing and I was about to upload the vlog for you guys, I didn't actually end the video. So this is me at the end ending this video i just want to say thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed the video i hope watching this video you guys feel somewhat productive i know it wasn't like the most productive vlog but i realized i'm just not a productive person in general i'm more of a last minute gal so it is what it is but if you guys like the vlog then um be sure to give this video a thumbs up also let me know in the comment section if you guys like vlogs because i realized that vlogs are actually like videos that i love to film surprising so if you guys like that then bonus for both of us because i realized that i love filming them and i also love editing them as well anyways hope you guys enjoyed the video and um yeah leave a comment down below if you guys would like we can have a chat i respond to all of my comments and yeah i will see you guys in my next video and yeah i have nothing else to say but bye guys mm -hmm.